Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna do a really quick get ready with me because I just wanna get ready. And <clears throat> I tried to use this foundation the other day on TikTok and it was just, it didn't happen because <laughs> it was like the, the sound got all crazy. So we're gonna try it. It is the, um, new Fenty Beauty foundation. It's the Soft Lit Naturally Luminous Longwear Foundation. Okay, I've heard that this foundation is supposed to be waterproof, longwear. It's going to be like a soft lit natural look, but it's also supposed to help control your oils if you're oily. Um, I am. <clears throat> and my biggest problem with being oily is that my nose my nose i think like i don't know what kind of oils come out of my nose but it's um it like breaks up the makeup it, i don't just get shiny it literally breaks up the makeup and i th i have tried to figure it out for a year now and i think it was because i was just putting on moisturizer and serum and then and i was using gel moisturizer okay but now i do the simplest thing um, I just put on my niacinamide serum or my vitamin C, whichever one I'm using that day. I don't put both. Um, and then I'll put on my sunscreen. That's it. Because I don't need, I'm not a dry girl, so I don't need that hydration. Even on my skin, like my around my face, I'm normal. I'm not dry. So that being said, that's why I do not use any more moisturizer during the day. Um, and if I'm not gonna wear makeup, I do put on moisturizer. But we're gonna go in with my Danessa Myricks. Um, this is the Yummy Skin um, Blurring Balm, but it's in the Universal shade. So yeah, you guys, my makeup, I was struggling. For a while there like I was like why is everything just breaking up on me if I would use a matte foundation it would be the matte foundation would just look so bad because around my face it would look perfect but like on my nose it would be breaking up and I'm like why why do I have to look like that what is going on with my face so I think it was just because I was putting way too much on, like I was actually using a moisturizer when I don't have to now at nighttime you better believe I'm using all the moisturizers and really heavy moisturizers and all the oils because I love to feel my face hydrated and even right now my my face feels hydrated okay so let's go right in with Z foundation I really I'm only gonna use one pump I'm not a girly that wears um, concealer and I honestly do not like using too much foundation because I feel like, I don't know, maybe for like more natural girlies, you would think like, oh, that's a lot of foundation. But this is actually, I've seen people like use two to three pumps of this and I'm like, okay, no, that's too much for me. I'm going to go in with my Live Tinted. Um, this is like a color corrector. And I'm just going to put it under my eyes here. And I didn't bring my brush. Sir, I'm just going to use this one that I'm going to use for my foundation. Just blend it out real quick. This is the um, Nikki, La Nikki La Rose um, N17 with BK Beauty. And my color corrector is just very light. Um, the liquidy ones kind of there's a lot of things going on with me but if you guys can tell when I smile I get a lot of creasing a lot okay so that's why I don't wear concealer because concealer just looks crazy on me and it's no good so let me go in with the brush first um, from Nikki La Rose here on my skin put it on my skin here Ooh, this looks so pretty. I love luminous foundations, but like I said, on me, it's just 
I can wear them in the winter time. Like I really can wear them. Um, or if I'm just going to have like a simple day and I'm not going to need my makeup to last all day. Yeah, I can wear them, but oh, I just almost poked my eye. Um, but your girl needs something also long wear. I can't just be wearing three hours of the day, you know, because sometimes we need to just have our days go on forever. Um, but yeah, I really like how this looks and my skin looks nice and plump and hydrated. Um, and that's also another thing that I was struggling with, like finding a good um, sunscreen that would work with my skin and not break up my makeup. Because like I told you guys, like even the sunscreen can break up my makeup. Like um, the Round Labs um, sunscreen this one because it's a moisturizing sunscreen it will break up my makeup like this is what I'm telling you guys it's crazy and it's just this area not even like my pores here or anything um but it's the whole shebang the whole shebang and always blend to your neck so you don't look like a floating head um but yeah it was now I use either this one, which is also Korean sunscreen. It's the Hyaluronic Acid Watery Sun Gel. So this is more like a gel. It does come out white, but it helps. Um, it's more lighter. And then today I used the, um, this one, it's called Ginseng moist sun serum it's beauty by Josen, and um this is the it's a serum so it's not as heavy i do have the actual sunscreen of that too so because i was trying to find a good sunscreen you guys i went crazy buying these korean sunscreens which i love them all i love them all but on different days you know so let me just my skin actually looks so good right now I love it. I love it. Okay, I think we're good now. Now, what I do is I will just set this part of my face. And sorry if it got dark in here because the sun just decided to go away. So I guess we're going to do like this effect here. <laughs> but I'm going to go in with my Huda Beauty in the shade Peach Pie. And I just, also a Nicola Rose um, brush in the N14 by, it's her collab with BK Beauty. But I love this brush because it actually feels like a fingertip. And it feels so good. It actually, I feel like it actually sets my powder in to where it needs to be. What do you need, baby? I don't want me. Okay, hold on, okay? Yeah. Go sit down over there, okay? Wee. David, go sit down over there. So I just set this part of my face, as you can see. Okay, now you go in my cream bronzer. My favorite cream bronzer is the Rare Beauty in the shade Happy Soul. I love this bronzer. I don't know, I feel like it's just the right shade. It works so well. Yes, my love. Okay. It just works so well. So I really love how this bronzer, and it, it just, I mean, you can see no, no work. And I know everyone raves about it, so it's nothing new, but just, telling you guys what mine is. I also like the um, LYS uh, cream bronzer and the Charlotte Tilbury, but I use them for different things. Okay, now sometimes I'll do cream blush, sometimes I won't. Today I'm not going to. Um, but let me, now I go in with this, this Morphe E48 brush I've loved this brush 
so much. I bought it so many years ago when I finally started doing my makeup because you guys, I used to not wear makeup. Um, I was a girly that said, never in my life am I going to wear makeup. And look at me now, doing it makeup video, getting ready with me. <sighs> the things you say, never say never. Um, but yeah, I was those girlies. I was like, no, I don't want to wear makeup because my mom and my sister were such girly girls. Oh, I forgot to blend this out. Um, that it was just like, I didn't want to be that way. Hold on, my love. Hold on. Go sit down, okay? Oh. I'll help you right now. Um, and I actually enjoy doing my makeup now. And it's not, to me, it's not like, oh... Um, you're just so conceited or whatever, you know, you can feel pretty and beautiful and not be conceited. <clears throat> and that is my biggest tip to people because honestly, you can be the prettiest girl in the world, but if you have a bad attitude, if you have that I'm better than anybody attitude, you're not as pretty as you think. Because it really does reflect on, on your like outer appearance, the way you act as a person. And to me, I never, I, I never walk into a room looking around who's looking at me. I never worry about what people are saying about me because at the end of the day, you guys, it just doesn't matter. Like it really doesn't matter. And I know a lot of girls, especially young girls, they feel so self-conscious and they're like, there's there's always going to be flaws with us, okay? There's always going to be flaws and, and we're always going to have insecurities, but it's all about just you feeling good as a person and who you are. Okay, now I'm going to go in with the Hourglass um, Radiant Bronze Light um, Bronzer. And of course, you guys, we have a family in this household, and my child will not leave me to make my video in peace. But it's okay. It's okay. We all have... <laughs> of course. Oh, the life of a mother is beautiful. Anyway, I just lightly bronze, and I like that bronzer because it's not too heavy, but it gives you the bronze look, and it has that little radiance. I know some people like do not like radiance at all. I love it. That's why it sucks because of my oils. I'm like, what is, what is the problem here? Do we have a problem? Do I need to fire you? Like, I don't know what it is, but it's annoying uh, because I love the glowy skin. I don't like the sweaty look now if you like it that's you girl but I do not like that sweaty look I don't like when girls don't actually set their face I like setting my face and still having the glow okay as you can see there's still some skin glow coming through okay this is the um, makeup my by Mario um, his soft pop plumping blush and it's the perfect pink I'm sorry you guys, we're all over the place in this video and we're just gonna have to go along with it because that's how life is. Life is not a perfect video. Life is not, there's always stuff being thrown at us. Now, as you can see, I put my blush here um, on my cheek, kind of close to my eye and also right here on my um, outer eyelid and then also on my temple because I just love when everything blends in so beautifully. Okay. That was a hectic moment there. Now, <laughs> nice and peaceful, quiet. Oh my gosh, my son is crazy. He is, like any child, very impatient, very impatient. He wants me to do everything for him in the moment. And that's okay, it's okay. We're trying to teach him to be a little bit more patient okay now I'm done with that I'm done with my face I'm gonna go in with the makeup by Mario the um, ethereal eyes I love this 
palette because it has these shimmers and his shimmers are just so good i'm gonna mix this shade and this one um and just and if i keep looking over here you guys it's because my mirrors here i'm as you can see i'm in my bathroom and that's why my son came in here and we have a bathroom out in the hallway but he always comes in here to go to the bathroom of course wherever mommy is if you're a mom you know and it's okay it's okay honestly i have been lo loving you guys i can do my makeup in 10 15 minutes i do I used to be the person that wanted to take so long and I've talked about this so many times but now I'm just like let's get it over with let's get it let's get it done let's get it going girl and I know I know you're gonna be like you can tell you do your makeup in 15 minutes shut up you know you actually can't um and that's fine like I sometimes wish i can get into that like face underpainting and stuff like that and i have the only thing is i don't use concealer i don't use concealer because of m the way i the way like my eyes crease when i smile i just i rather deal with the dark circles like we put shadow under there anyway um and using a little bit of color corrector with my foundation helps me like i don't know i just feel this is me. This is me. I don't contour my nose either. I love my chatita nose. I like my nose. I'm not saying people who contour their nose don't like their nose, but I know that they do it to get a certain look, and I like the way that I look. So, anyways, I'm gonna go in with this middle shimmer shade. I love it so much. You guys are gonna see. Like, just... A little bit I love just putting the slightest shimmer on my eyelids I think it looks so pretty and I put it like all over my eyelid I don't try to hone it down in one spot oh my gosh look at that can you guys see that it looks so good I love it it makes my eyes look magical if I if I'm gonna take a travel palette it's this one it has everything it has the shimmers it has the darker shades like you can do any look with this one it is so good and it's pricey but I honestly do recommend it okay now now your girl is gonna go in where to go oh never mind um, I'm gonna use these mascaras my holy Graham mascaras rare beauty and Ilia on top and if I'm looking down here I also have a mirror down here um, let me just put on my mascaras also another thing about me you guys is that I'm young I'm in my mid 20s and I'm 26 and I honestly do not find the need to party and I've been this way ever since I was small like ever since I was a little girl I'm just like I don't want to party I don't want to do that now if there is a party I will enjoy myself I'm not gonna be a party pooper and no I will enjoy myself I would have a good time but I'm just not that type of girl like I'm young and everything and you would say oh I I was born as an old lady is what I'm trying to tell you because I don't drink and it's for no other reason just since I was young like since I was five years old I've always had this mentality and you could say how is a five-year-old gonna have that mentality you guys if I would tell you how I was as a five-year-old it's crazy like I understood so much in the world and Ever since I was five, I just told myself, I don't want to drink. I don't want to be like everyone else. Don't get offended, but I don't want to be like everyone else. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to be different and not in a way of like, oh, I'm so different. No, it's just I didn't want to be a follower. Again, don't get offended because we all make our choices. But um, even when I was small and 
we didn't grow up with a lot of money. So when I was small, when we would go to the store, I would ask my mom for a, a toy. And if she said no, I understood why she said no. I, I would be like, okay, mom, like, okay, I understand because I knew we didn't have a lot of money. So I wouldn't sit there and throw tantrums in the middle of the store. And now it's like so surprising because now I think about it. I'm like, wow, I was not a regular kid. Like I was, I, I thank God for who he made me so much because he really has made me this person. And since I was small, he has made me the person I am. And I always understood so much because I see my son now. And like, if I tell him no, he'll throw a tantrum. He'll cry, which is a regular. It's regular um, as a kid. Like we want everything and everything looks cool. But it's crazy because I'm like, he really doesn't understand why he can't get a toy, which now I'm lucky and I'm, no, I'm not lucky. I'm very fortunate and blessed by God that um, I have what I have and I can give him all the toys he wants. Am I going to? No, because I'm not going to turn him into a spoiled brat. He needs to understand sometimes like, hey, you can't get every toy you want, you know, um, and that's how I want to like raise my son is like also having those humble roots and thoughts of like hey you know I have so much at home why do I need more um and being content with what we have too so yeah you guys I I'm just like so thankful to God and everything that I'm just like I'm I'm blessed to have the mentality that I have and I just keep trying to better myself as a person. But we're pretty much done. I usually don't do my brows. I'll do a like tinted brow gel, but today I am gonna do a little bit of brows. And I don't do crazy, you guys. My brows are not related. They don't even know each other. <laughs> if you can see, this brow goes down and this one just goes like straight. Again, I don't care, so it's not a big deal. Like, they don't need to look like freaking sisters or cousins or whatever people call. That's why I said they're not even related because they don't look alike at all. They're such different people. Um, this one's a party girl. This one's a stay-at-home mom. I'm just like, <laughs> okay. But yeah, going back to that, you guys, I was born as an old lady. And even now, I was just talking about this with my friend yesterday. I was like, um, I go out and I'm like, I want to go home. We go on a date night and we have the ability to stay out late. And I'm just like, uh, let's go home. Because I honestly, like, what is there late night to do? Go to bars, go drinking, go like, and me and my husband don't do that so it's just like i i can't afford to do this you know okay now um anastasia brow freeze gel this is the actual gel they came out with i always go like this because the little strings always um but i i just do it because my brows i don't actually like lay them down to lay them down because right now I'm just like, okay, I'm doing my brows after my makeup, which no good because the gel will like break it up. But my brows are so weird. As you can see right here, it like they grow down and then these ones grow up and here they kind of like lay all weird. So this is my finished makeup look and I actually forgot to grab my setting spray. Um, but that's okay. We'll do setting spray after. But I have been using the um, one size setting spray on till dawn because your girl needs on till dawn, even if she just wears her makeup for three hours. Because to be honest, I know that like my makeup breaks up. But the other day when I tried this foundation, it actually looks so good all day. And even around my nose. And I know like the way I'm doing my skincare is helping. And the way I'm doing um, like not using so many products. And also using the right setting spray and everything and powders. The Huda Beauty powder you guys is the goat. Like 
she Cody Beauty makes so many beautiful products. Let's do my lips because I always forget. I always forget to do my lips. Um, but yeah, she does so many good products. This is my favorite, and as you can tell right now, I'll show you lip liner. This is the Makeup My Mario in the shade Daniel. It's the perfect, like, pinky shade. Okay. You see how small this is? But I love... I love this lip liner. It is so good. I love the shade. You're probably like, breathe, Crystal. I am breathing. I love this shade. I'll use it all over my lips. Just like that. I think it's like, it gives me the perfect shade on my lips. I honestly love this look right here. And then some Lawless Forget the Filler in the shade. What is this shade? It's the pinky shade. It doesn't say. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And this is hair I did two days ago. Ooh, looks so good. I love how this came out. Okay, you guys, thank you so much for, for watching. Please follow me on TikTok and Instagram. And let me know down below what you guys want to see. I know I get a lot of views on my um, try-on hauls and everything, but sometimes I'm just like, oh, it life is life and right now I had a moment um, to do this and I'm happy that I did because I really love making videos and talking to you guys but let me know what you guys want to see from me next and give me a thumbs up if you like this video and I'll see you guys next time bye